Look, if you're here to pay respects to my mother, I don't want to hear it. She had it coming. Van, I'm sorry about what happened to your mother. Working under her for six years was one of the best experiences. You don't have to lie to me. I beg your pardon? I said, you don't have to lie to me. I know my mother was a controlling, vindictive woman. She treated her employees like they were nothing. She's ruined lives. Separated families. Destroyed dreams. So you don't have to stand there and say a word. Thank you for your concern. I'm fine. You can go now. Hey, that's not why I'm here. Then why are you here? Your people have already tried to call me. <laughs> not gonna happen. The reason I left was because my mother was involved with the devil. I knew she was going to get hurt one of these days, and I didn't want any part of that. I don't want control of this hell company. I understand, Van. I really do. But I'm here on my own account. Your own account? Yes, I agree with you. Your mom was involved in some shady things. Things that have hurt many people. You working with a detective? You can say that. I have powerful friends. Van, help me find your mother's killer. Maybe I can help bring justice to what Anita DeReese has created. Wouldn't that bring you some closure, at least? It would. Are you sure your friends can do these things? Yes, with all of my heart. What is it you want to know? Your mom has been meeting with someone called T for quite some time now. They've been discussing something called Lux. Tyrese Tyson. He's always signed everything with just a T. He's an old colleague of my mom's. They tried to keep their partnership on the down low for some reason. I didn't pay much attention. I don't know what Lux is. Do you think it has something to do with my mother's death? No, I do not. Is there anything else that you've seen or heard that you can tell me about? They were planning something big. Something to take their corpse to the top of the ladder. I don't know anything else though. I'm sorry. She began to keep things from me once she realized that I wouldn't have anything to do with it. Thank you for your time, Ben. I don't know what you plan to do or why. And I don't want to be involved, but be careful out there. You're going up against hell itself. One wrong move and he's got you. Who's gonna get me? The devil. Tyrese Tyson. You mean you never heard of him? You need to get out more. Head of Tyson Industries, the world's leading electronic manufacturer. Odd, but I didn't know he was conspiring with Anita. Interesting. I wonder if the other members of the movement know. would be out of character if they didn't. Guess the only way to find out is to have a little chat with Tyson. T has been located. I assume you have a plan for this? You're learning. Very proud. I took the liberty of studying the building's blueprint. Finding the floor plans was an easy task. I know it like the back of my hand. Symbol break and entry, huh? Absolutely not. Honestly, I'm surprised you made it this far in one piece. Luckily for us, I did some digging on Mr. Tyson and found out that he was a popular subject on Bruton Topics. He's apparently a ladies' man and not afraid to admit it. I'll go in and deal with him. Because you know how to make a man talk, right? Exactly. You're crazy if you think your charms will get you through this one. Look, you just cover me. I'll be out in 30 minutes. There's no way that he can deny this baby.
for Mr. Tyrese Tyson. I have an appointment. All right, give me one second to confirm. Yes, what is it? There's a, uh, what's your name? Shirley Monroe. Shirley, uh. Yes, I heard of what does she want? She says she has an appointment. An appointment? I never made an appointment. Oh. Send her up, Donovan. All right, Miss Monroe, you can head up the stairs. Forgive me, sometimes I get so busy that I, I forget that I have appointments. Uh, may I offer you a drink? No, thank you. I don't drink. Very well. So, I, Miss Marone, tell me, what can I do you for? Oh, well, I guess you can say I'm here on business. Uh, of course. I have a proposition for you that you cannot refuse. Well, forgive me. Who did you say that you work for again? I'm sorry. I should have mentioned that earlier. I'm from Sassy's Cosmetics and Human Augmentations. I'm sure you've heard of us. Yes, I heard about your CEO. She was such a powerful asset. She will be missed. Indeed. Funny you should ask about the CEO. Because I have a couple of questions concerning just that. You do? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Right this second, there's a sniper training his crosshairs on the back of your head. And I have to warn you. He never misses. You bluff. Does it look like I'm bluffing? Why don't you see for yourself? Look out the window and say hi. Don't screw with me, Tyson. I'd hate for you to end up like your partner. You move me, or are you someone else? What do you want from me? I mentioned a proposition earlier, so here it is. Tell me what I want to know, and I'll let you go. Refuse? And my friend will put a bullet in your head. Now, first question. You witnessed Anita's abduction and did nothing about it, right? Yes. How were you involved with Anita? We, we were business partners, and I couldn't refuse her when she offered me a part of the, the future world. Explain. She wanted to seize control of the movement herself and reap the benefits. And she was doing it, too, until she got overconfident and it got the best of her. So you're part of the movement? Well, not officially. No one really knew that we worked together and, and uh, we worked real hard to keep it that way. How are you two planning to take control of the Empire? We were stealing production plans from Hoffman Industries to use for our own personal gain. And Hoffman caught wind of this and I guess he decided to take matters into his own hands. And I ran because it was too much for me to bear. And at that moment of the attack, I decided I, I didn't really want to be a part of this New World Order. If you know what to do, make her suffer to her last breath. No one steals from me and lives to tell about it. Not even her. She will pay for everything she has done. Anita's death was my only way out. One last question before I depart from your sad and miserable presence. What is Lux? How do you know about Lux? Answer the question, Tyson. Lux, the, the light of the future. She began as a virtual intelligence, carrying out my instructions. My baby, my, my design. She was going to be integrated into autopiloted vehicles. For better consumer experience until the movement took her from me. So Lux is just a VI? How is it involved in the movement's plan? She's much more than that. Lux is able to learn, able to become more than what she was designed to do. I'm afraid of what Zara would do if... What did he turn it into? An artificial intelligence. Anita said that she was able to become much more than AI. In what ways, though, I'm not sure. I must go. My friend is watching you. Don't make any sudden movements until I'm gone. We will be keeping an eye on you. You tell anyone about this, it'll be the end of you. Thank you for your time. <laughs>